What is up guys? Welcome back to my channel. It is your girl Nisha Bryant and today I am back with the what is on my Samsung S21 Ultra phone. Uh, it's been a while and I'm sorry because I was supposed to do this right after but we gonna get right into it. So if you guys didn't watch, please go watch my unboxing and my accessories video. I will have it in the description box below. This is just the case that I have on it. And before we get started, I want to go ahead and give a shout out to the notification squad. To anyone who has been commenting in my YouTube community, in my YouTube comment box, I want to thank you guys. I'm going to throw some of you guys up here. A lot of you have been asking about the screen saver that I had on my last phone. Honestly, I can not find it I did get that from either Pinterest or Google I just don't remember and I don't have it saved in my old phone to give it to you guys I'm so sorry oh so keep looking and if you did ask I will definitely tag you in it and hopefully I find it right want to go ahead and start this screen recording real fast let me just clear out all this stuff all right I am about to start screen recording all right, so as you can see on the screen that I have here, it is just a picture of me this time. I definitely did not want to go look for a different wallpaper because, you know, I don't know, but I decided to do me. So I have three screens for my home screens. Uh, the first one, well, this is the third one. I'm going to go actually right to left. I'm supposed to go left to right, but I kind of just want to show you guys it. So this is just the background, the wallpaper that I do have. When you slide over to the left, you'll see here I have some reminders. And what this is, is just some reminders for myself. It's not anything that I'm actually reminding. Um, it's not something I'm actually going to check off and be like, oh, hey, I did that today. It's just a reminder for myself, a little motivation, a little inspiration. Um, I'll read a few of them for you guys. So the first one I have is procrastination won't get you your business back. And I say that because I actually am going to relaunch my business, but I've just been procrastinating and stuff. Not really procrastinating, you know, I'm a full-time worker and now I'm in college, so it's like, eh, it's a lot and I actually want to add some new things to it. Next one is college won't be easy, but it's worth it. So they say, so you're going to have to find out. Focus on you first. That's the main thing. Just make sure that you're taking care of yourself. Make sure that, you know, you're self-loving yourself first before you love and care for anyone else. If you give up now, you'll never make it. Let that grudge go. It's not worth your happiness. I definitely am a person who, like, basically hold on to grudges, so I am trying to tell myself to let that go. Saving will benefit you in the end. I do have a video coming out about savings. I know you guys all heard of something called the sinking funds, so I do have videos. Well, I'm going to have a video about that coming out. I don't know if I'm going to continue it or what, but make sure you're subscribed. Make sure you tune in. If you're not subscribed, pause the video. Go subscribe. Go drop a comment if you're here first. Let me know you're here, Chronicle Gang. And we just keep going like that. And scared money won't make no money. You guys know I'm a hustler. You guys know I like making money. So that goes without saying. I don't have to explain that. And if I do, then something's wrong. All right, on the first screen, I just have my... Um my calendar here so i'm not gonna stay too much in that because you know whatever let's swipe up so you swipe up on the first screen and this is kind of the same things that i have like on my old phone so if you watch that video you'll see some stuff you'll see a little bit of the new things the first one is just like you know aliexpress alibaba again if you want to start your business or you want to look to buy some stuff from there they have things on their website um that's just to start out with uh next i have amazon if you don't have amazon i don't know what you're doing my bank apps i have some camera apps so i do have a new GoPro 9. Okay, guys, this is the GoPro 9. I have my accessories and my equipment coming in for this, so stay tuned for that. It shipped out, and it should be here soon, but I'm definitely, this summer, I'm going to be tearing it up, all right? I'm actually going to purchase, I want to buy one of them little scooters. Uh, when I went away to Puerto Rico with my shorty, she actually... You know, I didn't have the GoPro at the moment. I was upset. I wanted it. But we actually got on a scooter, and now, like, I think I'm addicted to them. So I'm going to buy my own scooter. And then I also have the Image Edge Mobile. So the camera that I'm recording with now is my new camera. It's my baby. It is the Sony A6600. And the Image Edge Mobile app lets me connect to it wirelessly. I can send myself pictures. I can, you know, do all types of stuff. I can control the camera from the actual app here. This is feature apps. We don't care about that. Google Apps. If you don't have Google Apps, even if you're an iPhone user, you better have Google Apps. Oh, all right. You better have Google Apps because, listen, it's the best. I have Chrome. I have Drive. Drive, I just use for my school stuff. You can access it anywhere as long as you, you know, log into your Drive. Duo. Duo is a video app. It's between Android, so we Duo to Duo. But if you're an iPhone user, you know, if you are, and you want to video us, you can download Duo, and then that's how we can video each other. Um, Gmail, you know that is. Google, you know that is. Maps, you know that is. I love my maps. I use that whenever I get lost. 
I don't do that. We got Microsoft, then I have my money apps. So, you know, like Cash App, Google Pay, all types of stuff. Then we got Niche Tube. So, I got YouTube, um, YouTube Music, and YouTube Studio. YouTube is YouTube. You're here, so you know what that is. YouTube Music, I don't use. And YouTube Studio, if you are a creator like myself or if you want to become a creator, you should definitely download YouTube Studio. It will keep you up with your analytics. It can show you your comments. You can comment back to people. Matter of fact, let me just go to it real fast. Go to my comments. Um, and some of you guys, you will see that you're already on here. Um, I'm just going to pick a random comment and air you out. All right? Just a regular one. One lady had me, like, she was hilarious. Um, let me see. I'm gonna keep scrolling randomly, randomly, randomly. Uh, let's stop at, let's stop at Debbie Gordon. She said, I used this straight from Eden before. It was discontinued. I would like to try. And I said, I, I actually really like this one. So I already liked it. If you do comment, just know I'm gonna like it. I'm gonna heart it. Even if it's something negative, I will comment back. Like some lady told me when I was doing my detailed, um, my detailed washing machine video, she was like, oh, young person, stop talking so much and get straight to the point. And I'm just like, this is a detailed video. That's why I'm going into detail, but you can fast forward. I'm, I'm a funny person. If you crack a joke and that shit is funny, I'm laughing, okay? But yeah, that wasn't funny, but she's, you know, but whatever. Next time, sweetie, you can just fast forward. Um, yeah, but that's what that YouTube thing is there. All right, so next we have Samsung. Then we have my social media apps. If you're not following me on social media, make sure you do. Um, we have Anchor. That's what I use my podcast for. If you're thinking about starting your own podcast, Anchor is great. You can get paid on Anchor if you just, you know, they have something for you to do, like little sponsor stuff. It's not much, but, you know, if you're on Anchor and you get a lot of traffic, it can build up in due time. Instagram. You guys know what Instagram is. Let me just go ahead. Oh, that was me. And show you my Instagram. All right. So this is my Instagram. I just did my first IGTV video. I didn't think it was going to save to my actual feed, but um, it did. So, uh, yeah, I'm not going to play it for copyright purposes. Uh, I just put it up like 50 minutes ago. Oh, shout out to everybody who viewed it. Um, it's really up close and personal, but if you do want to check it out, you can just go check that out on your own time. But this is my feed, so make sure that you go and you follow the kid. My page is public, so make sure you follow me. And if you are from YouTube and you want me to follow you back, because I'm not going to lie, I kind of don't follow everyone else back. Or you want me to follow you back, just go ahead and put a like and a comment on the last post that I did, and I will follow you back. All right. Um, let's get out of that. Let's get out of that. Uh, so... Yeah, so Messenger is Facebook. Messenger Facebook is more personal, like family for me. So if you guys want to follow me on that, you can. That's a personal choice. Um, matter of fact, never mind, never mind. Don't follow me. I'm not going to drop that. Um, if Pinterest, I do post things on Pinterest. I find a lot of my ideas on Pinterest. If you're looking for like nail ideas, I find a lot of my nails on Pinterest and Instagram. Snapchat, make sure you follow me on Snapchat as well. Let's take some pictures. All right. I will have all my handles in the description box and I'll probably put it across the screen. Twitter, I'm trying to get back on Twitter. I'm, I'm trying, oh, well, this is a new phone, so obviously I'm not logged in. All right, um, my Sprint apps, I'm with Sprint. My Amazon, Alexa. I don't want to say it and activate her, so that's why I whispered it like that. But um, I have a story time and I don't know if I want to drop it. I don't know if I want to drop the T on this, all right. Um, Appy, which is the next app, that is just to basically create your Instagram post for the future. So you can make a post, put a description box, and have it scheduled to when you want it to post. Uh, with that, you only get a certain amount a week, I believe, and then the rest you have to pay for. So I just kind of just stopped. I don't know what happened. or oh, I forgot my login. Um, Best Buy, you guys know what that is. Bird. Bird is the app that I used when I was in Puerto Rico to ride the scooters. And that's actually the brand that I want to buy for the new scooter for this summer. It's like $500. Don't don't worry about that, but it's $500. Um, Blackboard is for school. If you're in college, you know what that is. Uh, calculator, calendar, camera, Canva. Canva is the app that I use to create all my thumbnails. Every single thumbnail that I've ever made on YouTube was from camera, except for when I first started. And I didn't know about Canva, but everything that I do is from Canva. Any flyers that I made, if you was on my IG story, you saw that I posted... Um, 
I posted something to my IG story and I basically said that I'm going live. So let me, by the way, if this video does go up tonight, which I'm hoping I'm going to try to get it up tonight, I'm going live on YouTube at eight o'clock. So just tune in for that. Um, yeah, but I posted something. Let me find it for you guys real fast. All right. So this, oh no, don't copy. All right. So this thing here that you're seeing on the screen that says live on air one night only, I made this on Canva. I could have possessed it up and made it a little bit better, but it was something quick, fast, just to get out there. I made this all on Canva. So if you want a tutorial on Canva, if I get about a good like five, six comments or like likes about Canva, I'll do it. So if you want to make a tutorial on Canva, then I'll do it for you guys. A Citrus MD, that's some bank, I mean some doctor thing. We have the clock, we have Clover. Clover is the app to my favorite seafood spot that's out here in Harlem. It's called Shaking Crab. So if you're looking for a good seafood spot, Shaking Crab, download the Clover app. You get points every time you go there. And then, then once you add up your points, you can start getting free stuff. Like I'm pretty sure I'm up to like some free french fries or something. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm up to some, let me see. Yeah, see, like I can get a uh, free Black Lives Matters t-shirt, free Cajun fries, free small gumbo, free mac and cheese. I'm almost to the snow crab. My favorite is the snow crab legs, but once you get a certain amount of points, you can start getting free food and stuff. That's how much I go there. All right, so credit karma is what I use to check my credit score. So if you need something to check your credit score, if you've never checked it before, you can use credit karma. Um, DJ Fly and DJ Mimo, those are two of my apps. So the DJ Fly was for when my brother came up here. He let me borrow his drone and I was flying it around and stuff with my best friend, which I didn't drop that video. Maybe I'll drop some clips or maybe I'll just do a separate video for that. And then the DJ Mimo is actually for the handheld... Um, cell phone gimbal that i have that i bought it just came out it's pretty cool so these apps are what that's for doc is for you know just regular dual mobile um if you want to um authenticate your i think that's called authenticate whatever if you want to um like let's say you get locked out of your instagram or somebody hacks it if you have dual mobile they'll send you some um They'll send you codes and you can, like I said, get my account back. This is how you would do it. It's one of the apps that you can use. Um, Etsy, shop on Etsy. You got to get Etsy. Eventbrite. Eventbrite is more what I use in the summertime. It's like a club event app. So if you're going out, oh, I'm, you know, it's crazy. I didn't move over this whole time. So I hope the, the thing don't cut me off. Um, so yeah, Eventbrite is when you like want to go to a party or you want to go to the club and it'll tell you like the events and the parties that's in your area or if it's an upcoming party. Like I used to like silent parties a lot, right? So I would go to Eventbrite and see when the next silent party was. It'll probably be in Queens. I would send out the link to all my friends like, yo, yo, we going, we going. And then that's how we link up. But Eventbrite has stuff like that. Also, if you're not like a clubber or you've never been to clubs and stuff and you want a club, um, that's Eventbrite is really good. Um, you guys know I'm a whole lesbo, so I would use it for like to find like the lesbian parties and stuff like that and go with my friends. Um, Evernote is just the app that I've been using for years. I take my notes with that, but it's not my main app. It's just, it's just my quick app. Like, if I want to just go ahead and take a quick note, I would use that. But to get more into detail, like planning out things like YouTube and stuff like that, I would just go ahead and use. You can see it's coming up. European Wax Center. Get your body wax. Get your vagina wax. Facebook, you guys know that is Fandango. Fiber. Fiber is if you want to hire someone to basically, they can do thumbnails for you, channel art for you, graphic designs for you. They can design your business cards. That's why I use for my business cards. Um, follower Analyzer. I, I think that's to see who's following you, who's not following you. I haven't logged in. Follow My Heart is the app for my dad. Um, and a lot of these things you guys already know. Home Depot. HP Smart is about the printer that I have. It connects wireless to my printer. I can print from my phone to my printer. I can print. Um, if I give you my printer's email, you can send something to my printer and I can print it for you without it being connected, no matter how far away you are. Because I've done it from here to Virginia. So Grubhub, you know what that is. I'm going to skip, skip, skip. Hugh Phillips, that's to control my Hue lights and my Alexa lights and stuff like that. Why y'all take my boogers out? Hulu, you know that is IGTV. You guys know what that is. Let's just keep skipping. All right, next app, Netflix. Netflix and chill with your girl. Notion. This is what I. This is the app that I use now to more organize my stuff. I was using Trello, kind of got off of that. But Notion is what I was using to like organize my stuff. Um, I'll show you something that I did. 
Oh, okay. I'm not logged into that either. Okay, it's a new phone. But I basically tracked myself when I'm working out. I'll put that, the weights I used, how many sets I did, stuff like that. Just to keep progress. If I'm making progress, if I'm going higher, if I'm going lower. Shazam. If you're listening to a song and y'all, like what I do when I'm in one of the H&Ms and they're playing that fire new song, I'm like, damn, what's the name of that song? You press Shazam and it'll basically um hear the song and then tell you what the song name is ship station i use for my business shop also can use for my business but shop is like if you're trying to track your packages everything that you use that email for it will come up in shop so if it's a tracking number if it's shipped out if it's delivered shop will just track everything in one instead of you like oh damn because i forgot i forget all the time what i order what packages i have and shop will remind me like oh your order just shipped um, Shopify, again, I use that for my business. If you're starting your business, I recommend Shopify. That's just my personal preference, but it's up to you. Um, Spotify, that's what I use to listen to my music. Stack Jump is just a game where you can actually, um, it's just a regular game. I don't have, whoa, I don't have games on my phone, but this is pretty fun. You just basically jump. I mean, it looks pretty whack. I died. All right, so it looks pretty whack, but um, honestly, it's something to do and it keeps you busy. The sound is something where I used this before to basically make my ringtones, but now the way this new phone is set up, you can actually use your um, Spotify music as a ringtone and as your alarm. So I was like, oh shit, that's fire. Um, but yeah, if it didn't have it that way, I would just put the song into Super Sound, chop it, trim it, screw it, and you know, add it there. Target, because Target is my life, Target app. Text free app, you know what that's hitting for. Yeah, I know what that's hitting for. I don't got, if you don't know what a text free app is, listen, if you don't want somebody to have your number, get a text free thing and give them that number. TikTok, I'm on TikTok, but I really haven't um, made any videos. Uh, this is me and my best friend. All right, I'm not gonna show you that. But yeah, that was TikTok. I know what TikTok is. To-do list, that's just something you could create a list to check off things for you to do. Um, Truebill, I just actually downloaded Truebill. So basically what it does is you'll link your, your debit card, your credit card to it, and it'll tell you everything that you've paid for on top of everything that's coming out your account a month. So I recently, um, cause again, I'm doing this, this sink and fund saving thing. So I was like, damn, I gotta see how much I'm tracking, how much I'm taking out. You won't believe the amount of money that comes out of my thing automatically by itself or subscription. So like Hulu, Shopify, Canva, a lot of things come out. And I was, I'm not, I was pushing like three something and I didn't even noticed that. But yeah, if you want to know what's coming out your account and you forgot like what you subscribe to or just something that you've never subscribed to and it's there, download Truebill. Now, I think it's free for the first seven days or something like that. And then after that, you have to pay. But they have a thing where you can pick how much you want to pay a month. So it's like three, four, five dollars. So you can, I think it's four or five dollars. So you can just go ahead and check that out. Um, Turbo, that's how you do Turbo Taxes. Twitch, I am going to start gaming again. I promise I just said that last video, but I'm going to try. Uber. You know what Uber is. Uber Eats, you know what that is. And the rest of the stuff is just basically self-explanatory. It's something that I don't have on here. It's something that I don't have on here. That I want to tell you guys about. Again, I can't remember it, but I know it's... Um, if somebody try to break it to... Oh, look out. Download Lookout on your phone because you can set it to where if someone is trying to like break into your phone and they don't know your password, it'll take a picture of their face. So just make sure that you um get Lookout. I didn't bore you guys too much. Uh, nothing really different this year. But um yeah. So if you like this video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you check out my video before this, my unboxing with my accessories. And if this video goes up before 8 o'clock, make sure you come back and tune into the live. I'm doing a QA, and a ask whatever you want. I'm going to have my wine. You have your wine. All right? And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.